Massachusetts may take a controversial step to confront the opioid crisis. A state commission is recommending the state try supervised injection sites. That's places where addicts can inject themselves while medical staff watches for possible overdoses. WBC's Gary Broad has the story. We have to think outside the box and we're going to take some risks. And nobody is denying that this if we were to do this, that this is not a challenge. It is a challenge. State Senator Cindy Friedman is on a legislative commission recommending safe injection sites in Massachusetts, allowing a person to bring drugs in and inject themselves under the guidance of medical professionals. The access really is to the patient and giving the patient the opportunity and the, 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 the facility and the education to move on to the medical assisted treatment. As a first year medical student at BU, Nicholas Chu says he got his first glimpse of the opioid crisis in a section of Mass Ave, infamously known as Methadone Mile. I remember walking to school um, that week every day and seeing people who were you know, clearly very sedated uh, dealing with opioid use disorder. Causing him to write a research resolution on the potentials for a safe injection site. I found over 100 studies. Um, none of them reported an actual death in the safe injection facility. I would like to focus on the stuff that we can do now, um, which is a long list of pretty significant and successful initiatives. Even if legislators give the thumbs up on a safe injection facility, U.S. Attorney Andrew Lelling may not let it happen. His office declined an interview today, but his spokesperson referred us to the comment he made last year, saying, I cannot envision any scenario in which sites that normalize intravenous use of heroin and fentanyl would be off limits to federal law enforcement efforts. This is a matter of interpretation. The U.S. Attorney General is reading it a specific way. We can go to lawyers and scholars in Massachusetts and they will look at the same law and they will say, we read this differently. We Boston Mayor Marty Walsh recently went outside of the country to visit different safe injection sites in Canada. We reached out to the mayor for comments, but he was not available. In Boston, Gary Broad, WBZ News. Gary